Hey guys, Jane Zero. Uh, I had a battery, uh, I'm not going to call it a failure, but I had a battery shortcoming in my uh, EEP solar light system. Um, so I called up my EEP guy, which is uh, Norm McGregor from Norm's Green Home, uh, the YouTube channel Norm's Green Home, and from his website. Uh, totallygreen.com and I'll put links to both of those in the uh, the about section and uh, it, this has been more than a year since I've had this up but EEP went ahead and honored the warranty and sent me a battery free of charge so now what I got to do is if you remember how I have this mounted from the installation video I just got a couple of screws in that plumbing strap screwed it to the wall so I'm gonna unscrew these top screws and unplug the solar panel and the lights and take that blue box off and when I get that done I'll meet you over at the table Alrighty, we got this uh, battery um, off the wall here. Like I said, I just un unplugged everything and uh, unscrewed it from the wall. Uh, what I was, was doing was <clears throat> this charge light right here, the charge indicator light, it would go from red to a uh, soft green to a dark green, and it would just go red, green, bright green, red, soft green, bright green. And the lights, uh, after a couple hours or so, the lights would start flashing off and on. And uh, so that told me that there was something going on, and that's when I called Norm and he said it was probably the battery. And these batteries are going supposed to be really crazy easy to change out, so let's see. Uh, looks like there's four of these Phillips head screwdrivers, uh, or Phillips head screws on each side of the box. And we are going to take this box apart. So let me get my Phillips screwdriver here. Remove these screws that hold the cover to everything on here. I hope I'm getting this all on the camera good. Uh, I'm not a very good cameraman, I know. So anyway, if you have one of these systems or you uh, are interested in one of these systems, um, I would still recommend it solely based on the customer service, man. I mean, they were Johnny on the spot. I, uh, I told Norm that there was an issue, and uh, he was all over it. Uh, he got a hold of EEP, and they were all over it. And uh, like I say, they sent this battery. Uh, they sent this battery to me and covered it under warranty. And uh, just a couple of days after I told them about it, I had a new battery. And uh, as everybody knows, I use these every every night I use these lights um, you know if there's any doubters out there you can ask people who've been here at my house they see them on uh, we use them a lot because they save a lot of money not having to turn on any other lights so and like I said it's been over a year since I've had this uh, since I've had this set up but uh, EEP went ahead and honored the warranty which is really cool and I appreciate that very much EEP thank you for your great customer service Let's see here, come on now. Yeah, there. Alright, <clears throat> let's take the cover off. And that's what we looks like on the inside. That is pretty crazy. Crazy easy. We have the positive terminal and the negative terminal. And then there's just one little uh board in here which I'm assuming is all the controls and the uh, the, the charge controller and so on and so forth here is the replacement battery that they sent I don't know if I can I don't know what all those words mean all them fancy words but this is the one that they sent to me and it looks like you just simply unplug this old battery here Huh. Yep, there's a, it's the same exact battery, by the way. There's the one that I just took out. It's the same exact one. And put in the new battery. And hook your positive to your positive lead. Take off these little covers. Hooking up the positive to the positive, and hooking up the negative to the negative. 
There's must be a, there's a little fuse in here right here. If anybody's wondering what that is, that's a little fuse. There we go. Got the new battery hooked up. <laughs> it was pretty easy. Now we'll figure this cover back on here. Oh, I think I got the wrong way here. Oh, that's right. <clears throat> Alrighty. Now we're just going to put our little screws back in. And there we go. Holes are lining up. Put a little screw back in here. And that was pretty easy. Pretty easy to switch it out. So let me go ahead and I'm not going to bore the crap out of everybody watching me screw back these screws. So I'm going to go ahead and put these screws back in here. And then we'll take it back over and put it on the wall. And I'll be right back with y'all. Alrighty, I got the uh, <clears throat> battery box back on the wall here. Like I say from the installation video, I just used some plumber strap and a couple of uh, drywall screws. Now we're going to plug the wires back in. This one was for the solar panel. That should make that light come on. The charging light. Sorry, I'm trying to do this one-handed here. Yep. And we start plugging the lights back in. Oh, I can get these out from behind there. Well, hang on a minute. I got I used my other hand. I got them back here behind. Hang on one second. Okay, now here we go. Start plugging the lights back in here. You know, everything goes just great all day long until you turn the camera on. <laughs> Alrighty. So there we go. We got our box back on. The battery's all switched out. It's remounted. Everything is hooked back up. Let's see if the light comes on. There's the light. Very nice. Excellent. Well, there you have it, guys. That was uh, very, very easy to switch out. Very easy to switch out. Um, Norm, I really appreciate it, man. I, at EEP, thank you very much for your, uh, you know, for your awesome customer service. That was really, really awesome. Uh, the way you guys did it and i uh, appreciate it so check out uh totallygreen.com if you're interested in ordering some of these uh eep lights the solar lights i can't recommend them enough i love the product and uh the, the dealer and the company it's all been good all a whole good experience for me so like i say i'll leave links in the about section uh to norm's green home uh youtube channel and to totallygreen.com which is norm's website which is where you can go to check out these EEP lights and get some for yourself because uh, mine have more than paid for themselves and have saved me a lot of money because I don't have to use power bill to turn the lights on in the evening time so all right y'all uh, I hope this wasn't a boring crappy video uh, thanks for watching y'all have a great day God bless in the end buzz buzz the end